um, both you, uh, Assemblyman Engelbright, and um, Speaker Hasty, uh, uh, supported the CLCPA that passed in 2019, correct? Correct. And that is a climate law that is more aggressive in the whole nation. Yet we do not have funding for that climate law. And the 35% that goes to disadvantaged communities, uh, we will not be able to obtain that if we don't aggressively fund the CLCPA. So I'm asking, are you both willing to support to get what we need by NYSERDA's reporting of $10 billion for climate law this year and ongoing? The answer is we are. Um, so one of the one of the the things that we have to do as legislators, there are twenty things that are important to us, and people bring to us an issue as this. And you're right, ten billion dollars is what has been pointed out that is needed. But it would be great if the only thing that we had to really fund was just ten billion dollars was for this. But because we have to put, you know, our budget is, you know, over two hundred billion dollars. But we don't have $10 billion. It either has to be raised, or Steve said, we have to bond out. I think we have to work on getting to that $10 billion. It's not just going to pop up overnight, because unfortunately, it's not the only thing that we have to fund uh, you know, in, in government. You know, Some people have wanted us to pass uh, you know, the, the carbon emitting dollars, be great as the federal government. State writes little checks, federal government writes big checks. So we need to get, uh, I'd say, a collective on how we come to the $10 billion. It would be very difficult for the state of New York on its own to say, we're going to put $10 billion aside and we have to fund the fund.